going to talk about sirens and about Maddie. So I'm just going to get straight into it after I tell you what it's about. It's about these two moon rays that are swimming in the water. And one of them gets caught in a net by accident. So she's on a boat now. And she hits one of the men on the boat. So then there are three of them. So one of them has to go call. And apparently they ended up, the military ended up getting involved and taking her and him. So then her sister had to get out the water and, and his friends was trying to find him. So the mermaid, her sister, the one that ended up getting out the water met Maddie and Alex. R. They always, I don't know if people notice this or if it's just me, it's been bugging me. Things like this bug me. They talk about Maddie's family. They discuss Maddie's family. And then they shut it down. It's not a conversation. It's like a, oh, well, you know, your family. No, don't talk about my family. Like, it's it's just a, a flare. But what they usually talk about is her mom or her feather tattoo. I personally think she's a shapeshifter. At first, I was convinced she's a werewolf. But now I'm like, maybe she can be a shape shifter of some sort. Because in the third or the second episode, she kind of talked about her family more than usual. And they said something about the night. Like, she's a night creator or her family. There's a, there's a story there. There's a theory. There's an urban legend story there. But... We just have to wait to hear it as fans, as viewers of Siren. And I just want to be the first one to say it. So when it comes out, people can be like, there was this girl who was saying that, like, she's an urban creature. I just don't know what. And I feel like she's a shapeshifter. So please comment if you agree or disagree. Or maybe you may have a different idea now that I brought this up to you for fans. And subscribe, like, 